Good morning to all of our lecturers. Today I will present my research proposal which is entitled How Brain-Based Teaching Strategy Enhance EFL Young Learners' Critical Thinking Skills. Before I continue my presentation, let me introduce myself. My name is Fadia Wihaira My student ID is 2206947. Let's face it, you're a teacher about to have your first time teaching your EFL young learners and vice versa with the children who have known English since elementary schools, but some haven't, and this is their first time. One thing is sure, success in learning English requires several skills, including critical thinking skills. At this point, teachers must understand the different characters of students and teach them in a fun way to achieve learning objectives. Interesting learning strategies are really needed in this situation. Brain-based teaching strategy stimulates children's brains so they are ready to learn it. According to Kane and Kane 1994, brain-based learning is the calibration of teaching according to how the human brain natural, naturally learns. Brain-based teaching strategy leverage our understanding of neuroscience to enhance learning experiences and optimize educational outcomes. According to Bernard and Francis 2012 and Sankov 2017, critical thinking is one of the important 21st century skills very suggested to be promoted to the students in academic realm. It increases overall information acquisition and trains st students to be more aware to the information they receive. This research involves specific methods such as classroom observation, interviews with teachers and students, and document analysis that are useful for replicating the effect of brain-based teaching strategies and measuring critical thinking skills. The first participant in the proposal to be made is one of the seven great in the EFL Young Learners class, the data collected was analysis and interpret based on the theory of brain-based teaching strategy and improving critical thinking skills in EFL classes for young learners. Classroom observation, surveys, and interviews collect qualitative data about students and teacher perceptions, and this statement is reinforced in document created by the teacher in the form of lesson plan that show the learning the learning scaffolding from the simplest activities to the most complex one. Belief in improving students' critical thinking skills.